Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. Hey everyone, Boomer here. Welcome to the second game of the Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. This next matchup, we are going to send you right to the Eastern Conference. This is the matchup that we are looking right towards into. The Boston Bruins are ready to battle again to face against the Capitals of Alex Ovechkin. I know this real game isn't that perfect for them, but it looks like there's going to be some of our teams that might be climbing in already. So, yeah, I think the other teams are better than the Washington Capitals, but it's too late because that one had started already because this wasn't the day to be like this. As for all of it being said right now, you may never get the feeling of what's going on, but if you have heard if the Washington Capitals may have stayed in the wild card game, you would have known that they would have won that game, and that would be a hard way to get this win done. So as right now, I'm sending over to the next commentator. I have the next one coming in right now. You know who? It's all courts. Just two. Along with Tyler Beast. And finally, the center race that we all have called for, you know, it's one of our biggest, and this is why I would like to bring somebody else in here. And it's one of them that you may never know. Life break. Now let's get right into game two of TD Garden Arena. I'll be back with the post game show. See you later, everybody. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to the Stanley Cup playoffs. We are ready to start things off here at TD Garden. The Boston Bruins and the Capitals are ready to get this thing rematch. And we are ready to get this thing set. While with me, Tyler Beast, and the Center Ice Lake Brain, this is NHL on EA Sports, coverage of the Stanley Cup playoffs. And here we go. We're about to get this thing started as the first save comes up here by Lindgren. The starting goaltender will be up as the outside has been whistled on the Washington Capitals. Now we're ready to do another face off here. Still no score in the start of the first period. Bruins wins the face off. Krasilchek will have that puck here in the right wing. Trying to give over to Coyle. Now he finds McAvoy. Marshade in the corner. Krasilchek finds again the posture knocks. That's blocked up. LaPierre's got that puck. Now we'll have it over right into the caps to the Bruins territory. Here's Wilson. Shoots! Save up here by, by Swayman. That'll be a starting goaltender for the Boston Bruins. That pack is broken up as Marshall will have it. And McAvoy will have it over. He went down that part. Sandine's got that puck. Now finds Carlson. Carlson looking it over. Try to get the pass to Ovechkin. Now find Wilson. Wilson working his way down. Rebound the puck on Ovechkin. Rebound on the shot. What a save here by Swayman. That's blocked up in front. Fighting along the rebound is Wilson. Now Ovechkin will have it. Lost that puck as Sancho will have it. The Bruins are the one on top. Strom's got that puck here for the Washington Capitals. He gets pushed over as McAvoy will have it. Give it in to the Bruins. Right around the angle. Save here by Lindgren. The starting at Lindgren is going to take all for his pressurizing, and this one turns to be all for it. Without Darcy Kemper and also Lena Salmar, I guess they're going to have to wait for a new replacement if there's another choice in between. The cat swims the face off as Strong gives to Jensen. No puck possession as the Bruins take it over. Here's Saka with a shot. Save here by Lindgren. A lot of time left in the period. We're underway still in Boston. Now with the wind here for the Bruins. Here's a race shot. That one gets tipped it over and it's now back to Kiki. Kiki on the shot. Saved by Lindgren. This one stopped to play here with only nearing a 16 minute mark in the first period. Now they're ready to do this one again. 
Bruins still have no score in the game after a last game win against the Capitals in game one. It was all that happened to be one of the better playing positions. And you know, that's what happens now. Sometimes it doesn't really help to bite the dust here, but you can always say now. I really would like to say there are always a full pressure range if you get that one clear. Carlos Shaw, what a save here by Lindgren and the strong as a back. Give it back to Heinen. Shoots, save here by Lindgren. Milano gets the puck. He will dump it into the zone in the broad Boston territory as Carlo will have that puck. Give it over to Geeky. Geeky right in the middle of the zone. Right to the slot. Saved here by Lingre on the pad. Carlson over to get in front of us. Protus trying to find our way to get right through it. And Frederick will take the puck here now. Find Heinen. And Carlo gets it back to Frederick. Frederick again to Geeky. Two on one opportunity range. Shoots on the backhand. That's clubbed up by Lindgren. It's a great backhand. You always got to know you got to keep that one in there as tight as you get. We haven't hit the midway mark of the period. Still on no score in the game in the second game. Fires a shot. He scores! David Pasternak shows the crowd what the response is. That's when you know because that turns to be like it's always a great thing that you give a good go-ahead rebound and take by Schoenberg. You can always say that when you give out the rebound, puts in for the strain, that's what happens to Pasternak. He made that one clear. Give it up a good head goal and took it here. As assist puts up by Kevin Schoenberg, Bruins starts off with a one nothing lead over the Bur over the Capitals. the face on this boomer spoon gets to Marchand. He's now in the wing, trying to get off the coil shot. What a stop here by Lindgren. Manfa now finding again a McMichael. McMichael right toward the wing in the bummer. Shoots it saved here by Swayman. He's going to cover up here with only 13-14 to go in the first period. Now let's have the call as we have Light Gray. White team for Alex Ovechkin. That's an all encounter range here as he goes with a one attacker and get right from here. Mark Marchand has one of the no contest to take all of his responses. He also sometimes goes for a heavy tip, but the traffic neutralizes can all bring out what the stoppable on their forceful play. He's that of the two and ranging him out, and I'll try to find out if Brad Marchand has a no contest and a match game with the one time team motion. Back to you, Testu. Now here's Wilson, we'll have that puck here, and he lost that one as up here, shot. It's blocked up. Shane Kirk came again to Pasternak. Boston back in the other side of his own. Take the shot. That one, Lindgren, take over. Two times stop here by Lindgren. You're never going to get away with that one, because Lindgren is really like trying to force on that one. Keep that one out of here as straight as you can. Wilberspoon's got that puck, and now trying to give it over again to Van Myers. Van Mayes with that puck. Shoots again. That's not going to get him here as that one's saved here by the goaltender. McMichaels goes down. That one's going to happen right now because the Boston Bruins definitely want some defense. Get that one right down. And Wolverspoon. Give the pass to Van Mayes. Battling along the puck in the center zone. Alexander has it over again to Portis. Now again to Manfa. Give down to Ben Myers. On the other hand, Ben Myers trying to look over. He finds Protas. Shoots the wall. What a save here by Swayman. This one stops it for the pack. That one's going to be a hard one. And you know, the pack on the defensive player is going to keep on coming down. Can't let that one get away with it. That shot's been blocked by Alex Ayev. Now finding off to be Kubo. Obey Kubo with the puck. That one's off of the finger, and it goes back again to Grislyn. Trying to get the puck out again. Grislyn with the puck. In again, find Heinen. Heinen with the puck, now find Grislyn. Shoots again. Saved here by Lindgren. You really are going to get that one a hard strength. That one's going to be a lot of great saves, and he's going to get that one down. I know he's definitely doing it really well. 
Jensen trying to fire again to Abikubo. On the attack, you're all ring. That one stopped by Kressler. And Frederick will have that puck with 8.10 to go. Shoots, and that blocked up here again by the defender. Jensen, as the Washington, they're back in position. Possession in the move. McAvoy takes a puck steal. That one, good poke check, got that one in there, good stick lift. Got to keep that one out of here. And Coyle will have that puck. Try to take one back. Lindgren takes a stop. Passing a 7.30 mark in the first period. It's a 1-0 goal for Boston. Now ready to do this one here again. Face-off is on. Now with the win, as Strom gives again to Carlson and Sandin will have it. Milano's got that puck. Try to go in the way, shoot! Save here by Swayman. Give again to Strom. Block the shot, and this one rebounds by Pasternak. He went down, oh, what a big surprise here. Give me that. That's what it happens. You always say you can give off a defender, but that's what you do. Close that gap, because that's a big hello over there. After a save by Lindgren, he chops the stick off, trying to get a new replacement here, and a new replacement for the man will come on here. Yeah, you're definitely going to have to pay that one with the stick. I mean, you're definitely out of here, and now he's going to back. Now Picurity will have it again at Carlson, now finding over his Strom. Strom trying to enter in the attacking chain. Oh, he went down. What a big hit. McAvoy can't hold on with the puck. The Boston Bruins are back in the air away, and now again to Lurie. Give again to McAvoy. And find Ben Mayish. Gap back again to DeBrus. Five minutes remaining in the first period. Lost that puck as Ovechkin takes it over now to Sandin. Sandin trying to go in it. On a quick inbound, taken away by McAvoy. Zach has got that puck. Well, there's a lot of big hits on there because the Capitals really want to get on the board. I don't think you're not going to handle that one if you can get there. And now up here, shot it! Save here by Swayman. Loray, again to Bazoo. Bazoo can't hold on with the puck here, and now it gets the corner back to Loray. Loray shot! Good catch by Lindgren, just 3.47 to go. Fans are ready to get to another face-off. One nothing to score in the first. Jensen's got that puck. Try to roll it over. Get the pass. And that one misconnected deep. We're all the way down to Swayman, and now he gives again to Locko. The man in the corner trying to look for a goal shot. Saved here by Lindgren. Now he finds Loray. Again to Carlo. That went wide off the mark. A lot of shots in the game here. This one's going to be like a hard one to take him down. If you're never going to get that one in there, we can't get that one stopped. And a big save by Lee Green with 2 for you to go. All that happens now because Lee Green just made that one fiery in the puck. Trying to hold on that one clearly and he almost hit that goal net. That one's going to be a leave it off the mark here soon, but you never get that one well enough if you can. Nearing down the final minute in the first period. Still a one nothing score for the Bruins. The Bruins wins the faceoff. Lover Spoon can't hold on with the puck and make that shot. Heinen trying to get in there. Shot saved here by Lindgren. Jensen now fighting over again to McMichael. And the team leads the Boston Bruins to the Cups. And now they're in it to Bruins territory. Shadow Kirk now finds Kiki. Kiki trying to look it over in between. That puck and chopped up. Kiki still has it. On a shot. That one's blocked and leave the zone out of here. Trying to battle along the board. And Mappa will have it. Kiki grabs the puck as the Boston Bruins are back in their own possession. And Shed and Kirk give it again. That one takes it over. We are down to a final of seconds remaining here in the first period. Just one minute remaining in the first. Shannon Kirk will have that puck here.
Try to cover it. It used to be Michael shot. And that one way wide off the mark. Heinen trying to get a shaking curve. 20 seconds in the first period. Looks a third shot. Saved here by Lindgren. And Myers gives the front of it. Try to look open shot. One timer just denies up by Lindgren with 4.2 seconds. Wow. Brewers wins the face-off, shot, and it's denied. That ends the first period with the first goal made for the Bruins. It's a one nothing lead. Get a clean sheet of ice, get ready for the second period. Glad you have us back here for today as we're ready for the second period. Second period starts now at TD Garden in Boston. Well, I have Tyler right now for the first period recap. Let's have your take. Well, they're really well doing it on an offensive possession. I really say that the Boston Bruins are really like hard working in between the offender and the defender. But one thing problem is, Goodwin really are trying to shut them down here for the Capitals. That they are really wanting to do this for a 2-0 start. But I've got a feeling that they might do this one again for more than any time. They could be doing this for more than once, but you probably may never know that this will happen most of the time. But we'll see what happens. He scores! Oh, what a shot made for Carlson. He ties this game up in the second period. Oh, that's what happens now. The thunderclap makes the noise, and you've got it all. See that? That's a firing take. When you hit that thunderclap with the puck on a stick, you hit that one right away. That's the first goal that we are looking for in the start of the second period. Well, as you always know, that John Carlson had made this thunderclap motion. He was to fire it and say, let it rip. And he just did. He passes right toward the goaltender. They are tied up with one, looking to see if they can get more. He went down and this stop again by Lindgren. And this one's off the shoulder again on Sandy. Can hold on with the puck as Tom Wilson will have it. And LaPierre will have it again. Wilson shot and stop made by Swayman. We passed two minute, one minute on the mark here as the Washington Caps are tied up, looking to find a goal in between. Where well, we're ready to get this thing set and ready for our face off. Coming up later tonight will be the Garden as the Rangers take on against the Tampa Bay Bolts. As of right at this moment, it's a one up lead for the New York Rangers. But the Bolts are looking to tie this game if this game comes to an end here for the second game. And then after that, Dallas Stars and Predators are ready to go back to Dallas for game two. And that will end the second game here as we will send you over to the NBA playoffs on the other side. That will be the, end, the next game underway and we'll be ready for game three and four back here on NHL on EA Sports. And now with the win, here's Edmondson. Can hold on with the puck as Zaka gets to McAvoy. Now here's another take here in the wing. He went down, oh! And Jensen will have that one clearing it over. Now finding again to Pacioretty. Now finds Strome. Strome trying to look over in the right wing. Giving it to me, Lando shot. Saved here by Swayman. Strome giving out. Breslick again to McAvoy. And now finding Van Myers. He takes a stop as Edmondson has it over. Jensen's got the puck. Right to the wing. That one hit off the goaltender and goes right to the board back to Milano. Big blocker stop here by Swayman. He always has to keep on coming down because the Swayman really has to give that one pressure. I just really have to say, this one is going to keep alive, going, and in, and again, and again. They really are doing this one as a hard one. They wanted to get this one over, and they can't leave the mark out of it. Mampus got the putt. Right toward the wing. Giving in the Jensen shot. Giving Michael, that was blocked. Battling for the loose puck, now finding again to Mampa. Jensen finds Edmondson. Shot! Saved on a glove here by Swayman. 
Oh, what a great chance here for Edmondson to take the lead, but it's denied here by the goaltender. Oh, it's going to keep on coming down, and you know what's going to happen? You're going to have to blind that puck and don't let it go in. That's what he does. Try to get that one deflected over, he get that one knocked out. Now Hyde will have that puck with 15 minutes in the second. Carlson takes the puck over. Now he finds Protus. Give it again to McMichael. One on one! He went down right near the net. Frederick takes over and now Carlo has it. Ovechkin's got that puck. Frederick can't hold on to it now. Now back again to Frederick. Try to take the puck lift. Carlson takes that puck away. Can't hold on with the stick. Ovechkin's got there in the wing, back in the middle. Should have slot! What a glove save by Swayman. He's been like ripping it, rocket through, and looks like he wants to take the lead over. I mean, don't let him get away with that. Nearing a closing game here to the midway mark of the period, all teams are tied up, looking for a goal to take the lead. The Bruins wins the faceoff as Greslick will have that puck here and behind the net, now by McAvoy. Moves again to Marchand. Off to Pasternak. With the rocket, save here by Lindgren. McAvoy, back passing to Coyle. And that went way off the mark and that one went behind the net as Pasternak got it. Backhander, what a save by Lindgren. Still a lot of time left in this period. Looking to get another face off, clean, look, clean and bound. Now the Bruins wins the face off. Here's McAvoy, can't hold on with the puck and now find Pasternak. McAvoy, to shoot, what a block by Wilson. Oh, he's got crouched down already, I mean, that's a great defensive work. Another hit by the Bruins! The bear is going to take him down already. You know what happens. Fear the bear. Take him down. Yeah, exactly true. And there's the penalty call. That's going to be on the Capitals with the cross checking. As Sandine is in the penalty box. They're going to call with the boarding call. 12.22 is the, power, is the penalty time kill. And now the Bruins are ready to take their power play. So wait for McMichael as Edmondson will carry the puck out. Now Shannon Kirk will have it over. Looking for a chance to take the lead for the Boston Bruins and now find Coyle. Coyle right toward the middle trying to take the shot as Ovech gets Carlson back again to Meliotstein. Here we go right toward the wing. Shannon Kirk back again to Meliotstein. Take the slap over in between for the wing. Such a shot! Over in the middle! He scores! Pavel Zatka! It's a power play goal for the Bruins! Well, I was wondering what happened here because that one really has to take over it. And Pavel Zatka, he, he messed it up with the save earlier, but this one has turned it over back to the Bruins. He had that goal. If they would have challenged that one, if there's a goalie interference, they should call that one here a no goal. But it can't because that one denied and that one got over. Now the win is the Ray. You will have it again into the Cats territory. He brush will have it. Shoots again. Save here by Lindgren. Tom Wilson trying to look over in for the offensive look. Pass again. Oh, that's good shot. And that blocker stop made here by Swayman. Zaka's got the puck for the Boston Bruins with all nearing the midway mark of the period. Sandine's got that puck now, find Carlson. Team it over now again to Pachere. Shoots it, save here by Swayman. Good rebound take as Zaka takes it over. Now the Bruins are back in the offense trying to pick up their look. Sandin can't get it fine in anybody as Carlson now giving it back over to Strom. Here's Moretti's shot. A big save here by Swayman and now going it over again to Carlson. And on the back of Brazeboy chain. He's got numbers. Oh, what a 
stop by Lynn Gray. That wasn't going to be a close call in between. I was not even expecting if Geeky would have had that goal, that would be like extension kill. Bruins wins in our face off a slurry shot. That's saved here by Lindgren. Bruins are on a full breakaway. Strong has it. And the team leaves the, the full strength zone and are now fighting again to put ready. The Gray, pass the shot. Saved by Swayman. Are you kidding me? That one turns out to be a wild save here. Without Lena Solomark, this one keeps on coming. Yeah, you know what happens. I just can't. I can't afford what is going to happen here because that was a crazy save. My oh my, what a good mistake. But they can have. And Kiki has it over. Battling for a loose puck in a chain. Frederick's got that puck now fighting again at Heinen. Heinen went down. Eight minutes for eight in the second period as Edmondson over again to Van Melstein. The Bros get out to Jensen. With a shot. Over again with a save here by Swayman. Boston back in the air on the attack. He fires that one out. The Capitals will have their possession here. And Pasternak takes the puck steal. I'll tell you, Bowery in the protest. Protest right toward the wing. Sidestep it. Shoots. Save off here by Swayman. Oh, Pasternak got a big hit here. Let's get physical, he said. Well, that was no other way that they were really are bound to bother us. I can't really say this, but that was a big hit. You're never going to get that down. Mampa trying to get to Alexiev. And McAvoy will have it. One on one back spread. Open man defender can't hold on. Shoots it. Blocked up. Brazil. Trying to hold on for Lingwin. And this one will stop the play here with 5.42 to go. Officials are getting ready for an art face off the. It's a 2-1 game, Boston Bruins. Now the win puts it in as Carlson will have it. And Sandine have it over. In the middle of the slot, what will he do? Shoots! Way wide off the mark. Grezik's got that puck here. Went down as Boquist with the puck. Here's Brazil. Can't hold on to that puck as Wilson takes that one out. Five minutes remaining in the second period as Lapierre will have that puck. Gives it back. Good poke to Wade here, but Ovechkin's got it. Take it over, scores! Oh, what a back-to-back -back range as Ovechkin ties this game up. It's now a once, and now it's a twos. Like you easier say here, Alex Ovechkin made that one slap enough here, trying to go over in between. Good screenplay. And that one takes it over here right by Swayman. That one's going to be like a heavy take. You got that goal, you got it incoming. Capitals and Bruins are tied up with two. Just about 4.37 left to remain in the second period. They are still a good team. They are not quitting here in a wild card position. They're trying to answer it back. Oh, I know that's going to be like a hard challenge, but the face fact is never consequence, never going to handle. You don't know what's going to be. But you're never going to get there. Oh, he's going to take the lead! What a save here by Swayman. Lapierre takes the puck. And DeBrest will have it. Now finds Loray. Loray has it now into the cap territory. Can't hold on with that puck as Sandine gives it back. What a big smash collection here on the board. Ovechkin's got that puck. Two goals, one goal in this game, and Carlson with the other. Both guys have one goals, looking to get two more. And now Carlson, sidestep it, inside the track, what a save by Swayman. 2.50 left to win the second period, and now back into the Boston zone, to the back zone. The rest fires it out, and a save here by Lindgren, what a catch here. Oh, what a save that comes in by. That's really going to make a hard one go right over it, and you can take that off. What a great play.
and the Bruins once again. Hot save here by Lindgren. And the puck takes away as he gives the motor spoon. Set a good shot. Save here by Lindgren. Lano will have it over now in the Bruins territory. Try to give up to Strong. What a stop. Picked up the rebound and save here by Swayman. This one is under two minutes for reading the second period. Trying to look over if they can. Now they're ready for another face up. Just about under two minutes, nearing the 90 second mark in the second period. Capitals wins the face off. Jensen can't hold it, and Swayman does it again. Nearing the 90 second mark, it's a tie game as the energy comes near between the Washington and Boston. Now the win puts it up again, and a save here by Swayman. The Capitals are under full pressure with under 30 seconds, but it's another face-off coming in attacking right in the way. Another win for the Caps. Jensen trying to get over it, and the glove saved by Swayman. Oh, that's going to be like a lot of attempts to get there. You're never going to get this one easy enough if you try to stop one. Last minute remaining in the second period. Still a tie game looking for the lead. Frederick dumps it out with the puck. Edmondson's got that puck here, racing inbound, trying to look over with an open offense. Now finds again to Strome. Strome trying to enter it in. Spins around. Can't hold on with the puck. Espressive will have it. 20 seconds remaining in the second period. Now back the other way. And Orlando will have it over. Orlando gives a show, he went down. Pasternak, will he get a deep shot? And not enough to get there. And it's the second period as Ovechkin ties this game up. Two and two is the score. We'll be right back with the third. Back your steps. Let's get in the locker room. And we'll be ready for the third period when you know it. We've come down to the final period in Boston. Ready to go. And we are all set, ready for the final period in game two. I have another one here as Tyler Beast will have more in a recap. Tyler? Well, it's always a great day, and I gotta say, this was a, like a wildest game in between, as you've all been seeing. Right in between of those two, it was the biggest moment of the game, but nobody has ever seen it coming down like that. But I'm going to tell you now, they've been really well working it off. He scores! Coyle with the goal! A go-ahead goal puts up the lead 3-2. Now I saw that coming. I see you, Charlie Coyle. After that pass, you just get a go-ahead goal, make that one-time count. What a great pass over as Matt Krzlicek will take his 23rd assist and his first assist in the playoff game starting with a minute to play in the third. Now I that's what I call that one here, great pass. Do you really like how this transformation comes up? Well I definitely do and wow, they're going back the other way. As Tom Wilson ties this game up, it's a back to back switch in between the Bruins and now the Caps turn. After that one going in there, and it's going to take that poke chip away for what the problem comes in. And this one's going to be a tight one in there by Swayman. You never see what's going on like this, because that one turns to be over like no one has ever seen it like that before. That's a pretty close call. Now with the Bruins on the win, here's McAvoy. Now over again to Marchand. Loses the puck as Sandine will have it over. And Carlson will have that puck right into the corner. Gets pushed down. Marchand with the puck. Here's the shot shot. Lindgren makes a save. Just coming down with an 18-20 to go in the third period. Now they're ready to do an air face off. 93 over 92, but a passing percentage. Getting a little bit better at that point. Yeah, I guess I'm definitely saying it's going to be like a hard one. Uh, let's take that all chance and hopefully we'll get to see what they go in. 
Now Wilson will have that puck in range in the corner. Now finding again. A wedge good shot. That one goes wide toward the net. And Swayman will hold on with just 17.50 left to go in the third. With the call, here's another one of John Carlson. Carlson is one of his ultimate thunderclap ability, making all time with a leading off score. When his wild and pretty rage, he puts a puck in set and takes a thunderclap here with a puck in motion by the stick. He makes a wild slap shot and has it all in between the range. We know for sure if it's going to keep on eye on a target, but I'll find out if John Carlson has an R1. Back to you. Ovechkin will fire it over, and this one stopped by Sandin. Ovechkin right toward the net. Wilson, Carlson shot. That's a great block here for the defensive settling. Now McAvoy will have that puck. Loses that one, as now it goes back into the, in the center zone. Van Miners trying to get the puck out of here. Zach will give it over to McAvoy. McAvoy, oh, he went down hard. That's a big hit. It's going to be like a hard one to take. Carlson on the wing. Denied by the goaltender. He got all of it. Lots of time left in this period. It is still tied up. Looking to see who gets the lead up in the second game of the night. And now Zacco will have it over again to McAvoy. McAvoy trying to swing over to DeBrusque. DeBrusque trying to flip over Van Meijer's going to move around. Oh, what a stop here by Lindgren. He's been working on here without Darcy Kemper. That may be a hard on the switch here. You know what I'm talking, right? Well, there is another way. I mean, I know what you're talking about that. I mean, this is where the hard one comes in. Now here's Gross like, shot! That was zipped off. Edmondson's got that puck. Now finds it again. Bangles out, now DeBrusque has it. In the corner, what will he do? Van Myers with the move around, he scores! Back in the lead, and this Van Myers with his first goal in the playoffs. Well, there's no way to defend that one, and now you all know, Van Myers, get that go ahead shot, go ahead and take it in. You know, it's easier enough now, that we, because of the way it works, he made that one clear enough. Lunging his leg forward and then right towards me from the slot. It just hit off and it just backed it out of here with the with the blocker. That is gonna be a hard one to take. The Bruins go back to back on the scores and now they're as if Jake DeBrus makes the assist. His first assist of the night in game number two, as it's still up ahead, four to three. Well you all keep on coming down because there was a lot of them to make a change off of him. But you have to do a lot of it more technique again. Now Zaka finds again the Brussels. Here again to McAvoy. McAvoy tried to look over in the middle. Towards again to the Myers. Lost that puck. What a save by Lindgren. Edmondson with the puck. Now finding over. Milano's got the puck here as the Capitals working their way across. But you're ready with the puck in motion. Shoots and save here again by Swayman. The Bruins will have their zone now finding DP. Top of the corner. He gets blocked out of here as Jensen tries to get that puck back. Well, you know what happens now because Jensen really wants to fight for it. said, okay, I'll take that one. Thank you very much. Geeky is all alone. Denies that one as Lindgren makes a stop. Oh, that was a hard breakout chain. That was going to be a close call. My goodness. And that shot went up high over the net. Hind and now find Carlo. Ovechkin battling along the board. Here's Carlson. Lapiri on a move. That went way off the mark. Wilson can't hold on with the puck. Ovechkin trying to fire it at St. May by Swayman. Lots of time left, but we haven't hit the midway mark yet. Four to three is where we left off. Left up here wins the face off. Sandy to shoot. That went wide. 
And a rebound has been stopped again here by Sleeman. LaPierre trying to get it back, but Loray has it. Keep it again to Carlo. And now over again to Marchand. Marchand has that puck. Now here's Pasternak. Looking in. No rebound put in as it's saved here by Lindgren. Sandine right over in the right wing, now looking for help. Trying to make a shot, what a saving kick out, and this one's deflected wide. 2 on 1 on the fast break. Going for it, and it's denied by Lindgren. Shoots and saved me again by Lindgren. Well, it's really like a hard way that Lindgren is trying to get that one over. Motion is countful, but don't let it take him over. Bruins wins the face off. Here's Marchand in the middle. That's Carlson takes a piece of steel. Dumps it into the wing. Boston back in the offensive zone now by Marchand. He got a tumble get here. Coyle now find Carlo. Back again to Loray. Leaving off the corner. Shoots and stop again by Lindgren. Protest with the puck. Looking to tie his game. And to save me by swinging. Are you kidding me? That was nowhere around here. What a save me here. And now goaltender is going to reflect on that to make a wild save. With another call, Charlie McAvoy has a stick of mobility. He has it all coming in here to make his all time worth it. But the credit it is to take is to pick the stuff up lifting. It's harmless, but none of it worth it is to keep on with the defensive settling. I'll find out if Charlie McAvoy has it down. Back to you. Rich Ready finds Strong. Now we'll have it in the wing. Try to get over in the middle, and it's going back again to Gresley. McAvoy now finds Ben Mayers. 8.30 in the third period, still haven't gotten the score for the Caps. That shot is blocked. Oh, the shot is scores! Pavel Zanka, two goals in the playoffs, looking to get his hat trick in the third. Well, you know what the easier way does, and this one's going to be coming in right away. And that's what happened on now. Yep, you got a good pass over to Pavel Zaka. Great pass over to Ben Myers. He had that goal right away, just keeping the go ahead and just make that win in there as well. Easier said than done. James Ben Myers got that one with the points in. And that one got, he made that one accountable in there to give it over to Zaka. He made that one a great settling to take all of his time. And that one keeps on coming. Here's another one with Carlson. That one's going up. A great stop made by Swayman. Oh, he tried to hold on with that battle and take. Saka right over in the wing. Now find Carlson with the puck steal. Keep again to Lapierre. Lapierre finding again to Wilson. Wilson. Again, a wrench good shot. Another save here comes big by Swayman. Oh, what a stop made by Swayman. 7-12 left to go in the third period. He's still ready to take his time, ready for an face off. Now the win puts in for the Capitals as Gresslick will have that puck. On a one-on-one -on -one fast break in the wing. Again, DeGrasse almost made it in there, but that stayed out of the net by Lindgren. Oh, that was very close. I mean, if that one wanted to count that goal, they know they would have to extend that lead. But that one got lucky. Krasik takes the puck. Now he's over and ready to take his time in his offense, looking for a more room. And a save puts up by Lindgren. McAvoy on the outside, going in. Save me by Lindgren. Still getting a lot of use of it on his work. Teams are ready to take their face off in. When you're in a fine five minute remaining on the final five minutes in a third, it's still a 5 3 game for Boston. Pine now, Pine Kiki. And Carlo taking the middle. It's deflected off to Frederick. On a straight up, and a 
nice save here. Washington back the airway now with Etchkin. Trying to go back down by one. Another pass save by Swayman. Carl now finding Frederick and now over again. Now to finding the Hennon. Over and battle inbound. Now finding Petrari. It's already trying to go in, he scores. They cut the digit down by one as now he's looking to tie this game near the end of regulation. Well, it's all waiting for long as Percheretti will have that one taking the goal back. After Van Mayuski got that one coming in with a slap. Always take him out if you got a right call to make the digit in there and just have the goal right about. The teams are back down by one as this one comes in between for 441 to go in the third period. Now that show wins the face off, and Mayus will now have it over again to Wilson as Petretti will have another one if he can get there. And Loray will have it. Now find Frederick. Over again to Heinen. Lost that puck as Schoen takes the puck away. Spins around the move. Milano shoots. Oh, what a big stopper by Swayman. Charla now finding another one to take the open angle. Up to the wing. Fine motion. What a save by Lindgren. And back to Alexiev and now again to Petretti. Battling, scrumming along the board as Strom recovers it. With a new line change as Strom takes it. Well, another shot. Saved by Swayman. 3 10 remaining in the third period. Trying to get the tie game before it's late in the regulation. Let's have the call. I have Blake Brink standing by. Alice Ovechkin did really well on this performance effort. He looks like he might get this one tied game if he can go for another one. But I say that Alex Ovechkin did really well with the shit. Hopefully you'll stay there strong and positive on the G Force. Stop me! Another one big save by Lindgren. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of attackers in there that's gonna keep on coming down. Not even a choice if you can get there. Boston wins the faceoff. Byron stop. Club saved by Lindgren. Nearing the two-minute mark, it's still a 5-4 game. Looking to get a tie in between for Caps and Bruins. But the full pressure is on for the Boston Bruins. Bruins wins the faceoff again. McAvoy can't hold on with the puck. Wilson now finding again to Ovechkin. He's propped up. Out of the box now. Trying to look for some tie again. Bruin man to shoot. That one's blocked. Wilson in. What a save by Marsh by Swayman. And now back again to Pasternak. Well, that's a close call because if range puts in the Swayman, trying to keep that from coming in there and bound. Puts it in as Gresick will have it again. A coil. McAvoy shot. That's saved here by Lindgren. Marshan trying to hold on. Gresick holding on to McAvoy. Glove saved by Lindgren. And we're near the final minute in the third period. 5 4 still the score. Always have to do if you can't get that one down there, you got to cover it up, or else it's going to be too late to get there. Now the win for Coyle. Greslick again. Back the way shot. Saved here by Lindgren. Under a final minute remaining in the third. And the save puts up again for Lindgren. Extra skaters on for the Capitals as the goaltender comes off. But now they're down to 30 seconds. They have to get there. McAvoy in the middle on the wing. Battling for this puck. Trying to get them out of here. And now the extra skater's on. Here comes Milano to tie it back this time. Swayman makes another save, and this one is keeping it down toward the wire. Fans are starting to go loud here in the TD Garden Arena. Five fours to score. Wayne puts in. Blocked up. And that will do. 
Did Brunsk will send them to win it? Locked his shot. And covering up, Famers scores. That's how you do it to end game two. Bruins on a 2 0 series. They win it all. Well, a great play comes in right now because that's what you have to do to make that win. And at that quarter inbound, that's a great goal to keep that one coming. Last face-off puck drop. And now we'll do. Boston Bruins extend their lead 2-0 over the Capitals. They will be ready to go on a road trip to Washington, D.C. And they will be ready to play against the Capitals in game three and four. What a great game this is. We all salute fans, why not? We really do appreciate the event. It's a great game to be here. Along with me, Test Tube, and Tyler Beast, and my friend, this has been a presentation of the Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Thanks for watching and have a great night. All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. Charlie Coyle is your third star of the game. The goal to assist him at three hits Gave a go-ahead goal and made it all. Your second star player on the other side goes to Pavel Zaka with two goals and one hit. Made that one easier enough and that's what you could do to try to keep that one out. And your first star player of the game, well say hello to one of our favorites, James Van Meijers. With two goals, two assists, and three hits. Here's how you did with the total statistics. 67 over 43 total shots on goal for Boston. 50 over 44 for Washington Capitals. Then it was 6.59.7 for the Boston Bruins, time on attack. Then 91% over 90 for Boston Bruins. 30 face-off wins for Boston over Washington. But then, penalty kill was happened to be Washington, and the power play goal puts up for Boston with 48 seconds. So, I guess that's pretty much it now. We got a great extension. Bam first, we're trying to get back into the game, as the Leafs have a 2-0 lead series. Then it's the Boston Bruins with a 2 0 lead series. It's going to be a great matchup in between, so you don't want to miss that one out for our next game. Rangers and the Lightnings are coming up next year at 7 p.m., so if you're staying around with us, don't forget, you can watch it here at any time right now by watching over the NHL highlights in between, so you can definitely watch it anytime over and over again. We're going to be playing some a little bit of like a uh, change up musical chairs to do some a little bit of like a switching commentators in between and then we'll get back into the game. Boom around of here. Peace out folks for a while as the NHL 24 on EA Sports style. Coverage of the Stanley Cup playoffs. See you next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.